Hello and welcome to session three of Igniting God's Purpose. Today we're going to talk about your passion. So far through this class we've covered some of the things that keep you busy and focused on the wrong priorities in life and hopefully you've been able to make some adjustments and reprioritize your life. Last week we talked about values and I hope you were able to go through the exercise to really land and operationalize the three top values in your life. And today we're going to segue into taking those values and praying and thinking about what are the passions in your life that you can tie those values to to really move forward in a new perspective. It's going to take some prayer. It's going to take inviting the Holy Spirit into this process because you have to believe that God does have a bigger plan for your life and He's already implanted inside of you that passion and that purpose that He wants to unveil for you to use that again will be your special path forward and will really ignite His purpose in your life. Today you're going to ask some hard questions in your group and go through the process of digging a little deeper into your heart. Think about what are the things that really make you passionate, that really excite you, that you could simply read, as unsimple as it is, 500 books on and never get bored. What could you do for hours and never get paid? Those are the kind of things that God has implanted in you that He wants you to uncover to really walk out a new life in Him, to fully ignite His purpose in you. And you got to believe that that purpose exists. It really does. The whole part of this process, again, starting with uncovering the practical side of what keeps you busy and then understanding your core values, leads right into this process of understanding your passion. But it starts with you being vulnerable enough with the group to unveil that, talk about those things that really, really excite you. And today's the day that you'll get a chance to do that. After you've gone through some time of personal reflection, made some notes, prayed to yourself, I want you to share with the group and again be open and vulnerable enough to put yourself out there and let them know what those passions are. Chances are the guys in the group will have the same understanding you do. They already know what piques your attention, what gets you excited and they can encourage you to step out in faith and walk into that passion with a more focused mindset. So use that with one another, encourage one another in your group, and then at the end, I want you to pray together. I want this week to be another one of those weeks where God just unveils this process to you that you get more and more excited about igniting something here and not just thinking about it, but doing it in your heart. So again, invite the Holy Spirit in at the end as a group and expect God to show up not only today in the group, but all through the week as he starts to unpack what may be so pressed down in your heart that you don't even know exists. So focus on the fire starter journaling method this week. It will continue to bring you through scripture that continues to open up your mind to the passions that God wants you to unveil. Have a great week, be blessed, and move forward learning to live, love, and lead like Jesus. Have a great week.